As of late, this seems to be quite the starting point. It's Sunday morning, Super Bowl Sunday. Welcome, welcome to the show. I am your hostess with the most, this Jen Cravasi. From Jekyll Bates, waiting on my sidekick, partner in crime, and fishing guy, CJ Wilson. He's probably stopped for coffee. Can't say I blame him there. So I'm just going to goof around right here for a little bit. No reason not to. Got my coffee in hand. The sun has come out. It's kind of like misty mountain hot this morning. And this Ozark clay and sand. It's quite pretty, isn't it? Got an eagle flying over there. Lots of pigeons. I saw a great horned owl on the way up this morning in pitch black. Flew right across the Jeep. Stunning. And uh, CJ and I have kind of mapped out a, a wee bit of a plan. Not a whole lot, but both of us are sort of in a more of a bass mindset just because. You know, the weather's finally starting to break, and, uh, and we've been catching bass. And you'll, here in Arkansas, you catch bass pretty much throughout the year. It's open water. It does get cold. Um, I just saw something rise over here. Can't tell you what it is. Got that train this morning. So, I'm just going to goof around and uh, toss a little piece of Gary Yamamoto 5-inch clear smoke Cinco in and uh, see what wants to play with it while I'm waiting on CJ. Now, generally, I'll try and skip up under this abandoned house here. part of the old dam house but I'm casting as we can see I'm casting a very long shadow this morning and this is gin clear water it's always gin clear water right here we've got a pretty good flow behind the dam as y'all can see I guess you can see and we've got mist coming up off the water look at this you guys man it doesn't get much prettier than that does it only thing better would be if, uh, if I were catching a fish right about now. But I'm just kind of dragging a worm. It's weightless. And get it out of here. See if we can get it a little bit further under this house. And I stand a chance of snagging. I know that. I don't care. I got plenty of leader. There's C oh, no, it's not CJ. That's uh, Spring River Flies and Guides. That's Mark Crawford. And uh, he's getting ready to guide this morning. Man, I think it's going to be real pretty if the wind will just stay down. Don't have much of a wind right now, but that could change. I 
It is uh, just before 8 o'clock in the morning. We had a little rain come through last night. Didn't change the pressure too much. Um, I would normally say that this is post frontal and by the looks of it, sure, absolutely. Um, you've got bluebird skies. You've got the moon in front of me getting ready to set. It's chilly, about 36, 37 degrees. I've got plenty of layers. I actually <laughs> remembered to wear my long johns this morning because you never know. Oh, I got a fish. I'll be darned, what do we got? Here I am talking to you guys. Come on, get out of there, get out of there. Looks like a little bass, a little green fish. Sure enough. Is it? That's a shadow bass. Da -da -da. Pretty little shadow bass. First of the morning. I hope that's a good sign. Come on, give me that. Give me that. <laughs> Took it right in the corner of the mouth. I got a little bit of grass on here. A little hair algae. Barely hooked it. Pretty though. Goodness, real pretty fish. They all are, aren't they? These guys are just real pretty. Uh-uh, come here. I'm gonna let you go, I'm gonna let you go. Open up. Let these folks at home see ya. There we go. Look at that pretty eye. Orange smoke eye. All right, get on back there, get bigger. See ya. turtle oh just a little guy hey little guy Did let's get go. no oh. he went after it I don't have it hooked at all well that's the uh, that's the catch of the, the beast of the week <laughs> <laughs> this one goes out to Mark Zona this is the uh, the beast of the week for Jekyll Bates. Get you back in the water, fella. I'm trying to hide. Right? Get away from me, you crazy woman! I don't know if it's possible to fall in love with a river, but if you can, I have with the spring. Okay. Little red's pretty good too. Let me take a picture. I hope so. I'd like some bigger fish than we had the other day. Ah, the journey downward. It's a whole lot easier second time doing it. I don't know what I don't know what my problem was the first time. Fish on. Little fella. Oh, little brown. Let go. There we go. 
very pretty. See you, little guy. There we go. Very pretty. Get them right back in the water, folks. Off he goes. Nice. <laughs> Take two. Big trout in this run, y'all. Holy cow. I just saw a dandy. And they are chewing me alive. I don't know how many more uses I have out of this guy. Not many, I don't think. Hopefully enough to get that one brownie. That's about... 17, 18 inches. That's not the cast. That is not the cast. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Ah! This area, oh man, that's twice. This area is just full of trout. This is a great big deep hole that I've found. And I could just sit here and fish all day. Brown. Rainbow didn't move far. Pretty. y'all see that? There's a fish. Good fish. Another brown. Beautiful. See it? Ah, dang it. Got that snagged. But, par for the course. Not getting it back. Oh, got it back. Got lucky. Got very lucky. Flip it over this way. Give it new life. <laughs> okay, all right. I'll leave you alone. 
I won't catch you. I could probably net you. Did you just realize I was here? <laughs> I think it did. I think it just figured it out. Fish. What do we got here? Is this trout? Yep. On a Jekyll bait. Nice. Oh, come on now. Almost. Excellent. On the jackal bait. I had him. You see, you see him on camera thrashing, and oh man, it was pretty. Um, on a green and yellow, similar to what you're throwing. You've got pink on the head. I don't. I've got green and a yellow underbelly. Swimming in or jerking it. Jerking it. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Pretty. Yeah. Yeah, this place is loaded with browns right here. Nice. Yeah, this oh look at this one. I hope that I have enough juice left on my camera to take a picture of this one. Yeah, real pretty. Wow. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. It's right in the top of the snout. Ah, I don't need the camera. We can see how pretty he is on here. There you go, bud. Nice. Come on. I, they'll tear it up. I'm telling you. Yeah, like a catfish. It's like a catfish. Yeah, they're all pretty. Stay put, stay put, stay put, don't. <laughs> you know, I do the same thing. Keep a pen, Jen. Come on now. They are in that rock. Pretty little one. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Every time they hit. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Good little brownie. Oh yeah, that's pretty. Good job, CJ. That's best brown all day for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Good one. Ah. Playful. Jumping. That's all right. Looks like it.
Whoa. There we go. Man, this wind. Yeah, it's going to keep picking up. Still a nice day. It's not freezing cold like it was last Monday when we came out. Dang it. You too? You trying to rip its face off? <laughs> yeah. Come on now. Yeah, trout usually gets me through the bass season, you know, <laughs> in between seasons. I like catfish. We do a lot of trout up in our area. Really? Where are you at? Okay, yeah, yeah, Black River. Sure enough, yeah. There's some good Kentucky spot on the black, too. Man. Start selling my buddy Richie. Not bad. I don't know if I can keep it pinned. That bit like it was about three pounds, but not so much. It's hard to get a... Well, in this wind, it's hard to get a decent hook set now. Up by the dam head? Yeah. Yeah. 